Hey guys, and welcome to the latest episode of the PlayStation 3 News. I'm Gogi, bringing you all the latest and greatest in the PlayStation universe on a weekly basis. Some pretty awesome news to get into it right now. Apparently, according to the Hollywood Reporter, uh, they have stated that David O. Russell is to direct the Uncharted Drake's Fortune movie. So it appears the Uncharted movie is a go. And that's pretty awesome. I want you guys to comment on that. And something for fun I want to know is I want you guys to comment on who, what actors you think or actresses will be great for the characters who will be good playing the roles. I think that would be fun to hear what you guys think of. And also for you uh, rock band fans out there, uh, Bon Jovi has stated that their forthcoming Greatest Hits collection is coming to Rock Band 3 as downloadable content. And also, uh, some awesome news about God of War is that the uh, specially marked boxes of God of War Ghost of Sparta will include a voucher for Deimos skin in God of War 3 on the PS3, if I'm pronouncing that name correctly. Now, uh, Deimos is the brother to Kratos. Now, what you're going to get is not just a skin to look at, but it will have enhanced combat damage, ability to receive four times the amount of health, magic, and god orbs. Now, the... If you want to make sure you get the voucher, the uh, the specially marked boxes are the two-tone entertainment packs and the ultimate pre-order bundles that will have the voucher. So make sure you pick that stuff up. And also, Killzone 3 Public Beta is going to launch October 25th. Now, uh, you have to go through a few steps to get this, and it won't be for everybody because there are limited amounts of spots, so make sure you're fast enough. First off, you got to be a PlayStation Plus subscriber. All right, and then after that, you ha on October 19th, you have to download the Killzone 3 XMB theme, which is only to PlayStation Plus subscribers. But, like I said, there's only a limited amount. So they stated that only the first 10,000 PlayStation Plus subscribers that download the theme will get a voucher to be in the beta. So, after you download it, make sure you keep it an eye on your inbox to see if you get that beta. But you gotta do it quick. October 19th, download the Killzone 3 theme on PlayStation Plus, and make sure you're one of the first 10,000 in order to get into the beta. And you will be required to constantly send feedback about it, because they want to make sure that they have the least amount of glitches and bugs and everything in there, make sure it's as perfect by launch. So, you, you know, make sure you do everything and anything in that beta to make sure the game is comes out perfect. And also, Sega has confirmed that there will be minimum cuts to Yakuza 4 for its Western release. Good news for Yakuza fans out there, because there were a lot of uh, disappointments, I would say, a lot of fan feedback about how much was cut from Yakuza 3. Like the hostess and a lot of side missions and uh, you know a lot of stuff like that. Well, they stated that there will be minimum cuts to, you know, a lot of the stuff from the Japanese release will still be in the Western release. They stated that the uh, the one thing they did have to cut was a game show called Answer Times Answer because they stated that in order to translate it into an English version, it would have delayed it a lot farther, further than its release date for next spring. So rather than de uh, delaying it a lot further, they just cut it from the game. Doesn't seem like that too big of a deal. And for you Dead Rising 2 fans out there, good news is you guys will be getting a ton of of downloadable content coming to the PlayStation Network. And we'll go over all this. Now, the first one that you guys will be getting is the Psychopath Theme Pack, which will give you a horror-themed outfit to wear and a bunch of new weapons, like the Chainsaw, the Cleaver, Axe, and Machete, and you will be pretty much more deadlier, too. And, also, and that will be coming out October 12th. Now, the next one after that would be the Soldier of Fortune theme. Now, this one is going to give you increased deadliness on all weapons and that one will be coming out October 19th the, the one after that will be the sports fun pack which will allow you to drink as much as possible without getting sick but a lot of people wish they can actually do that <laughs> and you also be more deadly with all the sports weapons and the last one oh my bad that one will be coming out October 26th but the one after that which will be coming out is the ninja theme pack this one will allow you to be pretty much undetectable to all the zombies and you'll be a lot more deadly with swords and throwing weapons that won't be coming out November 2nd a lot of good stuff coming and some interesting news this is only what I've heard so far but apparently they stated that Prince of Persia trilogy will begin an HD remake for Europe yeah I that, I haven't gotten too much information I don't know if it is coming to the US or whatnot but I'll keep you guys updated on that and what you're going to get with that is the Prince of Persia, the Sands of Times, uh, the Prince of Persia, the Warrior Within, Prince of Persia, the Two Thrones, 
all of them will be in 720p HD and in stereoscopic 3D. And that will be releasing November 19th. And also, Sega has announced Captain America Super Soldier for the PS3, 360, Wii, DS, and PSP. So no matter what system you own, if you want to be able to play as Captain America, now you can. And also, Dead Nation, some awesome news about this, will have online and offline co-op. Now, originally, online co-op was not actually implemented into the game, but because of the fan feedback, they wanted to be able to play online. And now they implemented it, so now you can play with any of your buddies and, you know, from all around the world online with Dead Nation, the awesome-looking zombie sh top-down shooter. That's awesome. And last bit of news here is uh, Resistance 3. Some uh, pretty interesting news coming out about this. Apparently, they are going to have a new main character. No more Nathan Hale. They said the new main character, if I'm pronouncing the name correctly, is Joe Capelli. And it will have new locales and possibly a new weapon system, which means possibly this game could play differently. All right, now, uh, like I said, there's, there's only a few stuff that leaked out, like I told you, because the huge unveiling of all the details of Resistance 3 will be in the next Game Informer magazine. That would be the Resistance 3 is the cover story, and they have full details on everything. Make sure you pick that up if you want to know everything first thing. And that's about it. That's what's going on this week. Some pretty awesome news. I want you guys to like, comment, subscribe. If you have not checked it out, check out my newest game music video that I uploaded earlier in the week on Red Dead Redemption, which you can also check out my other game music videos under my playlist on my channel. And I'll, before I go, I'd like to send a shout out, a thank you to all my fans out there. All right, I know my views have gone down dramatically within the last few months or even longer than that I don't know why exactly they really have gone down but I keep doing this and for you five to seven hundred or so that are still watching my video for all my true fans out there that still watch it every week I really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart I thank you so much and if it wasn't for you guys I would not be doing this you guys rock you are awesome and I really appreciate it but within the coming months my show is going to take a dramatic change okay I cannot give you a reason uh, or anything like that I've, let me just tell you, it's going to take a dramatic change on my show, uh, but it's for reasons I can't yet say. Let's just put it like that. So keep an eye out for that. But like I said, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you to all my fans, and I'll catch you guys next week. All right? Peace.